Good morning, guys. How's it going? Audrey, what are we watching? A song. A song. A song about Audrey. Oh, a song about Audrey? Wow, that's funny how she puts that together. I was just watching the season finale, series finale. If you guys haven't seen The Adventures, today it's up today. Go watch it. The last episode just went up. Here's a little sneak peek of Audrey's song, as hey she guys, says. welcome to the end of Dad Ventures. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> it's just kind of a look back. Kind of has a look back on the whole series. Yeah, I'll put the thing down below. Go watch and show some love. It's my last one. Hmm? Oh yeah, you remember that? That was so cute when you had that little stroller at the American Girl doll store. One of the cool things about this video, guys, that you guys will probably like, is it shows how much they've grown over the past nine months, which is really cute. Yeah. Especially you, because you are like nine months. You were basically a very tiny baby when we started that. Hey, I'll watch that song. Oh, you wanna watch the song? Okay, we're gonna go watch the song some more. So while the kids are chilling, I was just catching up on emails, and I just got my daily Zulily email. So I was just looking through and seeing if there's anything good, because, oh, more shoes. You guys don't know what Zulily is? It's the site where you can go and um, you just sign up, it's free and they have deals up to like 70% off on lots of huge name brands like Disney, Ray-Ban, Bugaboo, everything. And we actually, we just got some Toms, or I'll show them to you. We actually just got Toms for Audrey. Look at these. Audrey, do you remember these shoes? You remember these? Look at those. Aren't they so cute? Do you want to wear them? Yeah. Okay. Audrey, how much did they cost? Do you remember how much they cost? <laughs> they cost pink. Um, no, I think, I'm pretty sure Britt got them for $20? Maybe $25. But yeah, the deals on Zulily are insane. They're so insane, they make you want to cry because you get so happy. But yeah, the way it works is like each day, I think at like 9 a.m. Eastern, they have new deals that pop up and they'll send you emails and uh, you can just go to the website and you just browse through everything. So you can just come here and you just browse through. See, these are a bunch of cute like fall kids clothes. I mean, they have everything. So you can shop by category, all that jazz. Another cool thing is if you invite your friends and you get them to sign up, you can get an extra 15 bucks. So. It's a really cool sight. Oh, that's so cute. You put them on the wrong feet, but that's all right. Hey. We were just talking about how cheap Zulu um, is. Hi, were you really? <laughs> it's free to sign up, but if you sign up using our link down below, zulily.com slash nimenoles, you get an extra 15% off. Now, like I said before, all their deals that they have daily, they're up to 70% off, which is a crazy amount. But with our additional 15%, that could be almost 85% off that you get something. That's basically like getting it for free. They have all kinds of stuff. So yeah, if you guys want to go on your shopping spree, zulily.com slash nimenoles, sign up for free, you get an extra 15% off. Audrey, you look so cute. Come show off your toms. Where are we going, Audrey? Do you know? Church. <laughs> Church. <laughs> We're going to the zoo, goofball. I told you. <laughs> All right, we're here at the zoo, and the cuteness has already ensued. The cuteness has already ensued. This little booger and his fat cheeks are already asleep. Audrey, where are we at? The zoo. All right, we're gonna go find random things to look at. Kylan's awake. Look at us. I'm excited. I like we're gonna go find animals and look at them. Yeah. <laughs> what do you see? A duck. A duck? Where's the duck at? Oh, there they are. Say quack, 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 quack. Oh, look at that big bird right there. I know. I don't know what that is. It looks like some kind of fowl of some sort. Oh, look, here I am. Black howler monkey. <laughs> the black howler monkey? Where? Where's the black? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Terrible. Guys. Now everyone. Hey, she was oh, the one who made the joke, okay? Donkey. Oh, Jeez. you have to cut that out. No, I'm leaving They're it in. Get all I'm leaving it in for home. controversy's sake. I was saying it more because the, 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 the thing had a big mouth and I always. Because you howl mouth. a lot? Yeah, I do. I'm really annoying. Here she goes. Scream it again. Tierra de las Pampas. Ooh, Tierra de las Pampas. Tierra de las Pampas, I don't know what that even means. I always assume that these are like electric wires, but then I realized that's probably not true. Oh, it's a law. Oh, what is that? I don't know what that is. That is not a deer. It looks like a llama. Oh, it's a right here. A guanaco. I don't know what that is. Guanaco. Hi, Mr. Guanaco. It lives in Argentina and it can also be found in Bolivia, Chile, and Paraguay. And Peru. Ooh, guanaco. It also sounds like a nice Mexican salad. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get you. 
If you want me, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get you. The other nice thing about this place is that there's like no one here, so we can just run around and act like fools for the internet. <laughs> We're in Tierra de las Pampas, and I don't know what the pampas are. Whoa, a golden-headed lion tamarind. Yeah. Guys, look, it's a little monkey friend. Hi, little monkey friend. Hi, little monkey friend. Oh. Oh, he's got a little friend up there in the trees. Do you like the monkey? Is he your friend? Oh, he's climbing. Oh, look, he's climbing right there. I wish I was a monkey. Oh, look, he's climbing oh, he's too. Whoa. He looks like a grandpa monkey. Yeah, that's a big monkey. That's a baby monkey. You see that's that baby monkey? Big, actually, stop. Look, he's trying to Where's climb, that? but he's not as fast. Oh, yeah. Whoa, oh, that's you. They're crazy. Look at them playing. They're playing. Oh, wow, they play rough. Yeah. Yeah. This dude's just like, yup, yup, uh huh. I bet that's yep. the mom and those are the kids that just Oh, that's silly. I that's you and Kylan right there. I just called you monkeys. Oh, we found a camel. I see no one. Yeah, I mean, Audrey, why don't you just look at the one we're looking at? It's a camel. Why do we bring you here when all you want to do is just look at something for two seconds and then run I away? All right, why don't you get down? She was like riding me like a horse. She was like grabbing my hair and like whipping me around. I've always kind of wanted to ride a camel. I've ridden one before. You rode one where? At the Kansas City Zoo. I've ridden oh, really? an elephant in a camel. You rode an elephant? Yeah. Dang. You go hard. I'm just gonna drive me somewhere in this extremely raggedy Jeep. Audrey, can you drive us? Drive us somewhere here. I'll, I'll, I'll shift. Oh man, the shift doesn't work very well. Oh wait, you gotta hit the clutch. Hit the clutch. I think I, I think I killed it. I think I killed it. Okay, Audrey. Here, wait. Drive us. Where are we gonna go? Chipotle. Chipotle. All right, drive us to Chipotle. In here. Oh yeah. Over here at Chipotle already. Oh no. Oh. Okay. Can you drive us to Chipotle? Gosh, Chipotle sounds so good. We should totally get Chipotle after this. What are we about to do? Go round and round. Go round and round. What are you riding, Audrey? What is this? A panda. A panda. That's so cool. We saw this while we were over on this playground and it wasn't moving. We were like, oh yeah, it's just broken. And then it starts going and she freaked out. She was like, oh, it's working, they're all around. So now we're here. You so excited? Fun, Audrey? Yeah. Whee! We had a fun time at the zoo, although mainly all she wanted was this. Yeah, you got a toy. Tell, what toy did you get? A, a monkey She does a not monkey know toy. there is. She does not know why there, there are yeah. things but in there. That's fine. But um, yeah, so we survived and it was fun. Hey guys, what's up? It's me sitting in front of a computer again giving you random updates. Ah, this is the best part of the vlog, yay! I wanted to let you guys know a couple things. Why is my phone buzzing? Jeez. Basically, I'm gonna be at a thing next week called Social Media Week LA. I don't even know if you guys, if you're in LA, maybe it's something you're into. I think it costs and it may be kind of expensive, I'm not sure. But anyways, just figured I'd let you know. Okay, here's my little face on the little thing about the little things and there's, and it doesn't focus well. So yeah, there's my little face. So I'm gonna be doing um, a couple of like panel things or I don't know, I have this panel that I'm doing um, about like, you know, basically YouTubers brand deals, how it's all good for brands and YouTubers, blah, blah, blah. Then also a thing about being a full-time YouTuber. So that's all next week's Wednesday, September 24th. Just figured I'd let you guys know, cause I don't know if you're in LA or if it's something you're into. Also, why do I always do this? I always do this whenever I talk. <laughs> yeah, if you guys wanna come, uh, I'll be there. So I'll be there like all day Wednesday, September 24th at Social Media Week LA in Santa Monica. So yas, yas, if you wanna come say hi, yas, you can. Oh, also, I remember the other thing I was gonna tell you. I just uploaded the vlog that went up on Thursday and you're watching this on Friday. Uh, but YouTube sub boxes are broken. So yeah, it's been up for a while and it only has like 100 views or something because <laughs> no one's seen it. But um, yeah, so if you didn't see yesterday's vlog, I'll put the link down below. It's always down below, but go watch it, okay? I don't want you to be messing out on no videos, you know what I'm saying? I'd be like, hey, awesome, why don't you put up a video? And I'm like, I did, YouTube just didn't tell you. And they'd be like, what? YouTube, why wouldn't you do that? And I'd be like, yeah, YouTube, why wouldn't you do that? And they were all gonna sign a petition. It's gonna get on like change.org and we're gonna make a big deal. No, I'm just kidding, no, that's gonna happen. Hey, do you like this couch? You wanna, I wanna go up. You wanna go up? Yeah, I gotta 
Ikea. So we're here at Ikea. Wait, I don't know. Brittany has lots of things she wants to get at Ikea. I don't know, but who can't, who, who says no to Ikea? It's awesome. But as soon as we walk in. here because I was having envious problems because everyone in KC was going to Ikea. Oh, we didn't even that's have true. a Ikea when we lived in KC. Where in Kansas City is it? I think it's in Marion. I don't know. Oh, yeah, they're making oh, all no, the things way out in the middle of nowhere. But anyways, we walk in and Andre sees these couches and she's like, I wanna lay on it. So we lay on the couch. You can have your very own yellow bag. Do you want that yellow bag? There you go. Okay, well, I mean, you could probably sleep in that, but all right. Did you get a new bed? You got a new bed with a little cover on top? That's so cool. I think I'll just let's take this bed. I know it's for kids, but I can fit in it, right? Should I just sleep in this bed? Yeah. You're gonna sleep in that one, I'll sleep in this one? Okay, night night. <laughs> um, where did you go? Uh, I might have gone to Goodwill today again. You went to Goodwill? Did you spend so much money, like $20 at Goodwill? Cause you can get about half the store uh, but with $20. Yeah, all this for $22. Did you really? Yeah. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. She said, hey, let's do a, thr or a thrift store haul. All right, so here hey, we go. You guys should be proud, I didn't, I didn't get a mug. I really wanted to, but I didn't get one. Good, cause you don't have any room. random Oh. But it's a kid's plate, isn't it cute? What is that? <laughs> 39 cents. Ooh, it's, it's, what's that pan? Not because I thought it was cool. It's, it's an aerial bowl. But she'll like that. But she'll want to she eat out of Ariel. And stuff. She'll want to eat Ariel's face. I mean, maybe when she's in bed, I might use it once in a while. So when your dad was here, I felt really bad because I realized we only have like three pans, and he needed more pans. But this one looked like a really good pan. That is a good. Pan. <laughs> okay, it does look like a really good pan. Is it actually a good it pan? Weird. It smells. I'm gonna clean it. Don't smells worry, guys. like. Uh, watch all this. Smells like bacon grease and bo. No, but this, no, but this <laughs> is one of those pans that's really good meals. It also looks like a good pan. You could smack someone straight yeah, up with that. that. This has nothing to do with your thing, but I'm just gonna reveal something about myself that you may actually not even know that's actually really weird. Anytime someone rings our doorbell and I don't know who they are, and usually if it's a male and I just don't know who they are, if I ever consider opening the door or looking out the door, I go and I grab it a knife and I take it to the door. That happened the other night. You were gone. When have you grabbed? I've never seen you grab a knife before. You during the day, you open the door with a knife. Well, I don't usually end up. I don't usually end up opening it. You have someone I don't know. But like the other night, this dude, he was like, I think it might have. I couldn't see through the people well enough. I think it might have been a high school kid trying to sell something. But I just saw like a dude holding something, and so you literally grabbed a knife. I went to the kitchen. I grabbed a knife. knife. Just a big old butcher knife thing. News to me, I have never heard this before, and that is just. I also used to grab the knife every time that one okay. dude down below at our first apartment okay, would come up. I would always grab the knife and just, mm. if I answered the door, I would have it right there with me. Anyways, uh, Audrey and I were, it was just me and Audrey, I think you and Kai were somewhere. So you grabbed the knife and Audrey was just right there, and you're like, oh, Well, I kind of, I, I hid it, she didn't really understand what was going on. Are you yeah, I straight grabbed a knife. Because I didn't know what, I didn't know, like, if. All right, I've watched many movies. Uh, I've watched many movies. I always assume, do. I always assume if it's someone I don't know, even if I don't answer the door, you. they're gonna try and like bust the door open. Hey, that's smart. Because and then, that happened before. yeah, it happens. So I just assume, hey, if you're gonna bust the door open, I'm gonna stab you in the throat first. Do, because I usually don't open the door for guys. Cause I have no, I, I didn't even open it. But no, I actually, so I couldn't, I couldn't see. I turned the light on, and so then I see, and then he knows that I'm there, and then he rang the doorbell again, but I didn't answer, and then he just left. Uh -huh. Well, I think it was a high school kid, I, I didn't answer know. The door, but I only answer it if, like, okay, the other day this random guy did ring the doorbell, but he was smart. He did the thing work because he knew a woman was probably going to answer. He stood, he rang it, but then he went and stood, like, far away when I opened it. You know what I mean? Like, That's went, almost weirder to me. <laughs> That's <laughs> like, hey, no, I'm going to no, stand over here no, slightly menacingly no, 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 and you don't no, know. A lot of guys do it because they want to make you, they want to make sure you don't feel... Right, like, so when you actually, open the door, they charge no, you and they no. rush you and they bust in. That's, That's what happens. Anyways, I'm gonna stab somebody one of these days. Okay. That's a cool bowl. Cool? Nice. We could like serve things. White. Or you could put candy in there and put it next to your bed. 99 cents, you guys. You know how much <laughs> And this is like sturdy. Well, let me fill. Fill sturdy. Ooh, do you guys yeah, feel that? So Ooh. Like that. You never know when you're gonna need one of these, you know, for syrup. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's really cool. It opens. Are we gonna start our own IHOP? <laughs> I can't even remember the last time we ate pancakes <laughs> or something. You look at it too. Who wants to have milk out of that? <laughs> it looks artsy, okay? It was $2.99. Okay, okay all right. Good. You can make your own salad dressing in this. What is that? Hold on. This is really cool. You can make your own 
Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. Oh, recipe. cool. It gives you the actual and recipe. You can you make me Caesar, actually? No, look at though. You, you can literally cool. measure it in there. Like, it says two ounces. Like, it, like, gives you the recipe, and then it gives you, like, you just Yeah. I like Caesar salads a lot, but I can't stand anchovies. And anchovies uh, are in Caesar salad. Not all it's of on them. the it's on that thing. Not, well, anchovy not paste all, or something. Not all, not all Caesar salad dressings really? have anchovies in it. No. Nah. nah? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nah, nah boo. <laughs> now you tripping boo. I'm really proud of this purchase. And wait till you guys. Wait, did we talk about your hoodie yet? Oh my gosh, yes, my dank is dank junk. Is junk. Hey, calling I, I just want to lose all of our money because we are trying to we I literally have to buy every all of our friends have t-shirts like don't say, Micah, don't they have a t-shirt coming out? I think everybody, so. Everybody. Oh, days. man, Gabe and Babe, I don't think I got their shirt. I'm trying to buy yeah. everybody's shirts. Ralph and Lou have really cool shirts, too. <laughs> I literally am going to have Everyone has cool shirts. shirts. Look at this thing. Isn't this awesome? That is cool. Dang it's super ass cute. Dunk. Dang. Dang. And it's I also, also got, wait, is mine up here? It's I don't like know. Fleece. I got a long sleeve one. It's fleece lined, so it's super warm and comfortable. Yeah. This is my purchase that I'm very Whoa, proud of. Whoa, that's. Oh, guys, wait till you guess how much this was. Okay. That's, that looks pretty this cool. Is cute. That's hip. Isn't that cute? That looks like something you'd wear if you were going to LA. Billabong <laughs> is a really expensive brand. Yeah. Well, not really, but kind They make of. great bongs. Isn't that cute? That's really cute, look, actually. Look at, the, look at the detail. Okay, it's a little bit Ooh, worn, but it's still cute. That's, no, but worn is good. Okay, look at this. So how cute am I gonna be able to style this? Like super cute. That's okay. super cute. Guess how much this was. Three dollars. <laughs> what? Yes! Is it really three? Yeah, it was two ninety nine. <laughs> I know that thrift stores are super cheap. Does it, it like, does it smell like? Does it smell like three dollars? Smells good. Smells like a mix of leather and old ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, hey, let me show them um, a cool intro that I made up to latch. Thumbs up if you think Sam Smith should have used that. Do you guys think he should have used Ooh, that? Ooh, that booty though. You see that booty? That don't. <laughs> you said that. You said that about Kai in the vlog yesterday, and I, I was dying. Say, I have to say though, I kind of copied Elise because she always calls Kai's. Well, I know she, she does, does actually. Song, it's true. But she always says that dong, that and dong. so I totally copied her. Guys, thumbs up for Elise. She's super cool. Uh -huh. We like her. Actually, it was fun. Actually, yeah, this past weekend when my dad was here and Grayson and Elise were here, that was the most amount of time we've ever gotten to spend with Elise. Well, also, Audrey kind of thought that they all were going to live here all the time. <laughs> when they left, she was really confused as to Literally why. Literally three days there. later, she was, um, she woke up one morning and she was like, where's Papa Can? Where's Auntie Elise? Okay, bye.